Hello everyone, welcome back to another vlog. My name is Maria, if you're new here. Um, I just got ready for the day. Um, I am off so I don't have to work. I need some lip color because my lips, I don't have much natural like lip color so like my lips always just look kind of, my mom says they look dead. <laughs> so I need to put something on them. Um, like I said, I just finished getting ready for the day. I've got to um, get some more stuff together before I leave the house. I'm going to have a couple errands to run. And I am... Much better. I don't know why I tried to talk to you. I am... What was I even saying? I don't know. This lip gloss is so old, like I don't even think I should be using it, but you know, it, it does the job. Okay, I have to get my stuff ready um, for later. I'm going to my sister's because we have to record another episode of our podcast. Um, I also have to run to the bank and then I'm going to Trader Joe's, which I'm so excited for because I just love Trader Joe's and I desperately need groceries in my house. So I haven't eaten anything yet. I've had two coffees, so I'm gonna need food. I think I might stop at um, Dunkin' and get a sandwich because I love their breakfast sandwiches. It is a gloomy day outside and it's just like really rainy and gross. So. I'm not really looking forward too much to running around. Um, I will show you my outfit really quick. Ignore the mess in the background. This is like what happens when I try to get ready. And then my boyfriend Mike makes the bed and then you can see everything underneath it because he doesn't care about where that goes. Whatever, ignore this fan. Oh my God. This is also a bag of clothes that I need to give to my mom and my sister so they can go through it. Pillows that Mike chooses to not put on the bed, I guess, whatever. So I have this um, cute white shirt on. I think it's from, I think it's from Shein. I'm actually not entirely sure. And then I'm wearing these white joggers from Boohoo. Um, my slippers right now, they're from Walmart. I freaking love them. And then I just have, let me see here. I just have this little gold choker on. I'm pretty sure I got it from Forever 21. And then this gold bracelet here was my grandma, so I can't tell you where I got that. Um, but yeah, I am going to get the rest of my stuff together and then we will get on with our day. Okay, um, we're back. <laughs> I cannot tell if I like these boots with this outfit. Um, I think I do. I'm just gonna leave them because it's raining and honestly I just like don't really care that much. Um, these I have literally had since like high school and I'm 25 so I've had them for a very long time. And then my hair, I am leaving it out in this ponytail which I also never really do. Um, I haven't washed my hair since, today's Tuesday, and I haven't washed my hair since Saturday, so I'm actually kind of like shocked that the curls still look okay, but yeah, it's a cute low pony look. My hair is getting so long, I need to get a couple, I need to get a trim, maybe a couple inches off of it, we shall see. Okay, I am just ordered a Dunkin' and I got... I was just gonna get a sandwich because I'm hungry and I um, already had two coffees this morning. And she was like, do you wanna add a free medium coffee for coffee day? And I was like, yes. So I got freaking got another coffee. I am gonna be caffeinated AF and it's like so bad when I do this and I know I shouldn't do this because I mean I just like get shaky so I'm just gonna sip on it since it was free I don't have to you know drink the whole thing am I gonna probably but I just got a uh, hot coffee with one pump of pumpkin and two creams because it's like freaking nasty and raining out and I didn't want anything iced hopefully like my food will be ready because the last time 
not the last time, but like before I ordered food and then it wasn't ready. They're like, can you pull over and we'll bring it to you? And I was like, yeah. And then they just like couldn't find me and I had to go inside anyways. And I was like, y'all, come on now. So I'm going to have them, I need to get this ready so I can get um, points. <laughs> and I got the little like everything bagel stuff bites or whatever. I've never had them, but I was watching Rachel Ratke, like one of her old vlogs. I'm freaking obsessed with her right now. Her vlogs are so good. And one of her old ones, she made homemade everything bagels. And I was like, that sounds so good. And I freaking love bagels. And I don't have bagels at my house because like I said, I need to go grocery shopping. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you, have a good day. You too. Okay. I'm gonna have to eat this in the car and I'm wearing white. So I don't think that's gonna go well, but you know, is what it is. There's only so much, ow, this is freaking hot. There's only so much I can do in this situation. So I'm gonna get my sandwich ready so I can eat and drive, which um, I probably wouldn't really recommend, but you know, whatever. Okay, I made it to Trader Joe's. I've officially been in the car for an hour and a half, and I am very much over it. Trader Joe's is an hour from where I live, and I had like a bunch of errands and stuff I had to run and do on the way over here. I'm trying to park my parking spot. I thought that guy was leaving, but he's not, but this guy is, so heck yeah. Um, Trader Joe's parking lot is like freaking insane, always, and they used to have like a guy out here like directing traffic so yeah it's pretty crazy but i'm gonna snatch this spot because it's like close to the front which is awesome because it's raining i hope there's not a huge long line because i really don't want to have to get my umbrella out just to wait in line and then like have it in my cart and all that kind of stuff i am just gonna sit here for a second because honestly that was a oh my battery's gonna die honestly that was a stressful drive over here um with the rain i don't know why but lately my car has been hydroplaning really bad so i don't know if i just like need new tires um i also need new brakes like my brakes have been squeaking and um i don't know if you can hear this like all of that nonsense i don't know what that is like that's been happening my seatbelt doesn't work and it works i just have to like really get it in there and oh i am just like i've just been so like stressed the past couple of days and then yesterday i got off of work and i went to get in my car and like i could like on okay when I went to the gym yesterday morning, I like left my car door open for a second. And then when I came back to shut it, I could hear something rustling around in my car. And I was like, something is my car. And then I was like, no, Maria, you're just being crazy. It's probably just outside. It's fine. But then I was driving to work and I could hear this like rustling again. And I was like, something is definitely my car. And I like, didn't know what to do. And so then I was like, whatever, like you're just being crazy. Well, I got in my car to come home from work and I shut my door and then like right here, was this huge i kid you not it was like the size of my thumb it was like this big this huge like prehistoric moth looking thing and it was just like flying around and i jumped right back out of the car and i called mike and i was like there's this bug in my car and i don't know what to do it's in my car and i whatever and i was like just freaked out so i'm a little bit anxious in my car i'm pretty sure it's gone or it's in here and it died <laughs> so yeah and just with the world with the way it is and people at work like my work environment's not the best because we don't have any staff so we're all overworked and we're all stressed out and we're all just like snapping at each other and i'm not here for that and the people that come in like they're angry and mad at the world and so they snap at us like and it's just i'm just a giant ball of stress and i need to just let all that stuff go. Like I can't change any of it. And the only thing I can change is my own attitude and how I handle things. So I'm going to happy up. I think I should get out and get in this line. It looks like there is a ton of people walking up. So I'm going to grab my mask 
grab my reusable grocery bags. Um, still have this coffee, it's kind of making my heart race. So I'm like not really into drinking the rest of it. I barely drink any of it. Um, and uh, yeah, I will probably see you next when I get to Anna's, we'll see. Well, I'm at Anna's now, and she just told me that she met somebody that I followed on Instagram for so long. It was kind of a big deal. Kind of a big deal. Like 50,000 followers worth of a big deal. And Anna's no the clue. owner. I'm just kidding. <laughs> and I had no clue, and she was super nice, super cute, super cool. And then I was like, oh, I'm going to tell Maria. And then I just like saw what I looked like sitting like, <laughs> and I was like That is so frumpy, ugly. And I told her, and as soon as I said her name, she was like, <laughs> damn. I really was though, I knew exactly who she was, and I was gonna come to Anna's today, like I told you earlier, and then I wasn't, because it's freaking raining, and now I should've. Anyway, she's an Olympic lifter, and she like qualified for the Olympics, and I have literally followed her for like years, and I missed my shot. You should've been there, dude. I really should've been there, that light. So I just naturally DM'd her. <laughs> Yeah, we just like, we straight <laughs> slid into her DMs. Okay, well she posts she posted a story of Anna's work because that's where Anna. <laughs> not even because that's where I work. <laughs> well, because that's where you saw her. She oh, came yeah. into where Anna works and was um like recording an episode for her podcast or she was. No, recording... she was being a guest on someone's. But yeah, Whatever. she also has a podcast. Yeah, she also has a podcast, and Anna didn't shout it out because she's a classy bee and. <laughs> They don't want to take her shine if we're talking about her podcast. You don't want to outshine them. No, exactly. No, you were right. Yeah, I wouldn't have either. Because like yeah. I hate, I hate a one upper. I hate people do that. It's a and one upper. Also, it's yeah. Like, look at me, look at me, and it's like I'm listening to you. So right. Exactly. I'll tell her later. She um, when she replies to our DM. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, she was recording to be on somebody's podcast, and anyways, I'm kind of salty about it, but it's and fine. She. This lighting is so much better. <laughs> lifts right down the road from me, literally a mile away. Should we go? <laughs> Should we do it? Should we do it? I'm not gonna do it, girl. I was just thinking about it. <laughs> Cuts to a clip of the gym. I did it. <laughs> no, but anyway, I don't know. Pretty cool. I don't know why she's here, though. We'll have to stop on her Instagram and see if there's like a reason or whatever oh, because she's like. She says she's gonna be here for a while. So anyways, next Tuesday. <laughs> I'm just kidding, I don't even know what I would say to her if I like. Hi, I, I love you. <laughs> you don't know me, but I love you. <laughs> no, exactly. I don't think she's seen it yet. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, let's check. <laughs> Shout out Instagram for that sick feature. We're gonna podcast in a minute. Yeah, we are. I'm gonna tell my story on the podcast probably. Actually, I should save it for the podcast because I really want your reaction because I think it'll be funny. It's nothing crazy, it's nothing crazy. Anyways, we're gonna get to it, bye. Looking from your telescope, take me on this journey home. I don't wanna wait no more. Lay me down behind the moon, tell me you'll be on real soon. I don't wanna wait no more. Dancing in the stars, we could be floating all the way As long as I'm safely in your arms And it don't really matter where we stay Cause space Space makes me sad Good morning everyone I have incredible morning voice um, It is the next day I just woke up, I slept in a little bit longer than I meant to but I really needed to do that. Um, I, haven't let the, <laughs> I haven't let the dogs out yet because 
I need to have a second without them like fighting around me. <laughs> I got home last night and Mike was kind of stressed so I didn't want to like shove the vlog camera in his face so we didn't do that but I just went home and made dinner, watched the um, presidential <laughs> debate. It was interesting. And now I need coffee very badly, so let's go do that. here on um i really need to drink this coffee because i cannot even make like full sentences right now but anyway speaking of my coffee it smells really good so let's see i think it's good um it's not like a Okay, yeah, it's good. Um, it's not a super strong flavor. I was almost expecting it to like hit me in the face, but I like that it's not. Um, I'd like to say that I don't like super sweet coffee. Um, I do like when I go to Starbucks and stuff, but like when I'm at home, I don't make anything like super sweet or anything like that. But yes, would recommend. But she, <laughs> she oh yeah. Oh, you know, eight years. Yeah. Later. Ew. Jeez, if one of them comes over and gets pet, the other one has to come over and get pet. It's like freaking kids. Okay, I have been sitting here for probably too long now, and I. Oh my god. Marley's the only one that really kind of chills and does her own thing. I am going to get up and kind of pick up the house a little bit. Um, I need to shower and wash my hair, and then I want to put some self-tanner on. I'm very pale, and I want to put some on my face. I don't have the best skin. Like, this is all marks and scarring. This is all marks and scarring. The only, like, active, like, pimples I have, I'm, like, touching the frick out of them right now, and I need to not, is, like, here and here. Like, I only have a couple, but, like, my skin just looks so bad. Anyway, I want to try and put some self tanner on my face to see if maybe that'll like blur that out, but then I'm also scared that it'll make me break out. I don't know. So before I put the self tanner on, I need to like pick up the house and like do the dishes and stuff so that way like if I <laughs> like get water on my hands while I'm doing the dishes or if I'm like doing the house, I don't want to like mess up my tan. Because after that, I can just like sit in bed. I need to like edit a couple of videos. I need to finish up editing uh, the episode of the podcast that's going up tomorrow and all of that jazz. So, oh my God. That's why when I get up, I like don't let them out for a little bit because I just need quiet and that never stops. Okay. Yeah, I know. I know. <laughs> Feeling 
that Pluto You already knew though I'm hiding just behind the stars But how come the stars don't shine When it's day How come the sky at night Makes me this way Why are you so far away Galaxy cast away Watching you hopelessly some self tanner I am looking much darker than I was before um, I didn't put any like product or anything in my hair just because for the next like week I'm going to work and I have to wear it up so I just didn't want to waste all my product when you're not even gonna be able to see my hair so I just threw on um, this big loose dark t-shirt just so my tanner doesn't rub off um, these joggers I don't really care about don't really like slippers and it is i don't even know what time it is it's oh it's two o'clock so i will probably leave this on until about um like nine or ten or so and then shower it off i prefer to let me just say down. i prefer to sleep in it um but I didn't put it on last night and I need to schedule a workout for the morning and um, I don't know my work schedule yet but I'm assuming, I don't know, whatever, just to be on the safe side, I have to schedule it for 7am so I don't want to um, get up and shower this off before I go do that and then I also don't want to work out in my self tan because it'll get all gross. So that's probably when I'll take that off. Um, I am going to make myself another coffee with you all real quick. I look much darker over here. I'm going to make another coffee with you all really quick. Um, on my days off, let's do another one of these guys. On my days off, I like to do an afternoon coffee and a morning coffee because like when I'm working who am I kidding when I'm working I get an afternoon coffee too I just have to buy it out All right, really quick it's really good and then I'm going to get my water that I just made and didn't grab um, I put the dogs up in the crate because I had to vacuum earlier and then sometimes I don't like to leave them out while I'm in the shower because somehow one of them always finds something bad to do. Last time I took a shower, Pansy took one of my plants, like ate it out of the pot and then took it onto my nice light colored rug and it ended up being fine because I caught her but I was just like, you know, that ain't it. So. I'm gonna sit here and um, I'll probably watch some more YouTube videos because Wednesdays, today's Wednesday, I don't know if I mentioned that. Wednesdays are my days to do absolutely nothing and then absolutely everything that I want to do at home because I um, am off on Tuesdays, like you saw yesterday, but my Tuesdays are always booked up because I um, go to my sister's and we do the podcast thing and then usually that's my day for like errands so I pack everything into that day so that I can sit here and have this day to myself. Um, Mike is at work so he's not here right now. He was off yesterday. I feel really bad that my um, like days off, like the way I plan that doesn't line up with his day that he's off. He's off Monday, Tuesday and I'm off Tuesday, Wednesday. but. He's very supportive of me and like doing the podcast and like YouTube and all that kind of stuff. So he understands and he doesn't care. But I do try to get home early so that I can have an evening with him. That's always really nice. 
So last night I didn't show it because like I said, he was really stressed and I just felt, I read the room and <laughs> I just felt that that wouldn't be the best idea. So I, yeah, I'm gonna sit here and watch some more YouTube in peace. And then I'm going to start editing my, um, finishing up the podcast and uploading it to the host site and things like that. Look up from your telescope, take me on this journey home, I don't want to wait no more. Lay me down behind the moon, tell me you'll be on real soon, I don't want to wait no more. In the stars, we could be floating all the way. As long as I'm safely in your arms, and it don't really matter where we stay. <laughs> I don't know what it is about her and like smells. She does this to Mike too after he puts deodorant on, and every time I wash my hair. Okay, stop, stop. Don't lick my tan off. Why do you do that? Let me just get my hair out of the way. Pansy's been chilling with me. I just finished editing the podcast episode. My hair, because I didn't put anything in it, is so frizzy and I hate that, so I might just put it up in a little bit. Girl! <laughs> yeah, I know, that's what you get. Ow, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Chicky, Chicky, you should calm down. Calm down. I can hear your tail. <laughs> yeah, you're so happy. Why don't you just like lay here? <laughs> Pansy's Gotcha Day is coming up in November. Um, also. I don't know if you can see, but I get so much of her hair all over me. So, I mean, I'm staying home, so it's whatever. But her gotcha day is coming up in November. I'll have had her for three years, and she's turning four in January. You're getting old. <laughs> it makes me sad, but I love her so much. I rescued her, and she was like just an anxious mess she's still an anxious mess like so much to the point where i feel the need to talk to the vet about anxiety medication for her um just because i feel like it would improve her quality of life because like if one little like little tiny things set her off and like she'll freak out and then she'll she just like paces all day long and it's just like not normal things and I know there's like natural stuff you can do, like CBD and stuff like that, but I've given her like a full dropper of CBD before and it didn't really help that much. So I think she just needs like maybe actual medication. I don't know. And she like obsessively like licks and chews. That's what I'm trying to get her to like stop like on herself. So I took her to the vet one time because I thought it was allergies. Like I've taken her before because she was just scratching and scratching and then like she had spots where her hair like fell out. They told me it was allergies because she's white and I just moved. And so I thought she had allergies again because she just like licks and stuff. But when I brought her out of the vet, they were like, yeah, she's definitely got some self-harm spots. And I was like, that's so sad. <laughs> anyway, so I, um finished editing the podcast um my podcast with my sister is called pop off sis um you should definitely go subscribe to that um it's on wherever you get your podcasts and leave us a rating and review we really appreciate that follow us on instagram and leave a comment and dm us we love to interact with you all um and now i am going to edit a youtube video i think while I'm watching YouTube. I watch YouTube like it's freaking Netflix or something. Like I only watch Netflix when Mike is home and I'm with him. Just because he wouldn't like the YouTube videos that I watch and the vloggers that I watch. They're a little girly for him. But yeah, I'm gonna do that for a little bit and then 
maybe get up and get a snack or something like that. I don't know. I'm still trying to figure out my editing style with my videos. Like I only have a couple up and um, I just haven't found anything that I've really liked and really wanted to stick to yet. So I'm going to mess around with that, I think. So yeah, that's where we're at in the day. Okay, the air is blasting. I have to keep it on a little bit because it's freaking hot. I should probably take my sweater off. <laughs> okay, I stopped vlogging last night um, just because I really was not doing much. I laid on the couch and caught up on, oh God, listen. Did you? No, you could not see how close that was. Holy cow. That truck was too big to be parked in that small spot. Anyway, um, I stopped vlogging last night because I really wasn't doing too much. Um, I was just laying on the couch and watching YouTube and really just taking the opportunity to freaking relax for once. Um, I do have a full-time job and that's where I was just at this morning. And on um, one of my, I get two days off a week and on one of my days off, I jam pack it full. And so it's really like I'm off in the sense that I'm not at work, but I'm like busy. Like it's not like relaxing. Like I'm just like doing a bunch of stuff. And so I really just took the opportunity to have a day to really like not do anything. So that was really nice. So I just, yeah, took that break. Um, I just got off of work now, not off, I'm on break. And uh, I went to the gym this morning. I didn't vlog that just because, oh my God, my, I need to get my nails done so bad. It's like catching my hair. I didn't vlog it this morning just because it was so early. And to be honest, I like got up kind of late. So I was rushing to go do that. Um, went and worked half of my shift. I'm getting an extra long break today, which is really nice because it's very slow and there's gonna be enough people there to allow me to do that. So right now, I'm on my way to my PO box. I need to check my mail. Um, fun fact, I don't get residential mail at my house. I don't have a mailbox in the mail. Even if I did, mail does not run. So I have to have a PO box and it's right down the street from my work. So I'm gonna check that because I haven't checked it and honestly, I don't know, too long. That's for sure. Um, so yeah, after this, I'm going to go to Starbucks and um, sit and have lunch and um, edit a video. And then I'll probably go see my mom, I'm not sure. Um, I could edit a video at her house, but honestly, like I get so much work done when I'm sitting in a coffee shop. And when I'm at her house, I feel rude and like I should be visiting with her which like I should be so um, I might just go sit in Starbucks and do that for a little bit and then if it doesn't take me the whole time I will go and visit her for a minute so yeah that's what we're doing Space makes me sad. Cause... Space makes me sad.